Hey there, thank you for joining me for today's practice. My name is Paula. Today is just a very short and sweet, just neck and shoulder reset. Perfect to just break up your day and just kind of bring a little bit of life and movement into the neck and the shoulders. So let's make a start straight away. So we're going to start in a seated position. Feel free to sit on a blanket or something that elevates your hips a little bit just to make yourself a bit more comfortable. And we're gonna start with the right leg in front of the left. If you wanna do this in a chair, most of it you can do on a chair as well. So your choice. Let's just take a little moment just to begin, just resting the hands down to the legs, closing down the eyes. Just connecting with your breathing. Picturing the length of the spine all the way from the base, and tailbone, sacrum, lower back, middle back, upper back and neck. Energy reaching up through the crown of the head and also grounding down through your sitting bones. Let's take a deep breath in through the nose and out through the mouth. One more time like that. Inhale through the nose. Out through the mouth. And then just coming back to breathing in and out through the nose, blinking open the eyes once you're ready. Letting the arms just be down by your side. And let's just start with some shoulder circles. So shoulders forward, up and back, forward, up, and back and again forward up and back and let's reverse let's go back up and forward back up and forward just noticing how your shoulders are feeling as you continue to stay connected to your breathing and just finishing off that last circle and then let's bring the tips of the fingers to the shoulders and bringing the elbows together or as close as you can together and circling the elbows back so we're trying to make some nice large circles, but just whatever size, whatever's available is completely fine. Trying not to flare the lower ribs forward. And then let's change the direction of the circle. So we're going back, maybe the hands come towards one another and elbows come together as you come forward to see how you go. Noticing that kind of circular rotation in the shoulder socket through this action. And one more, and then let's release the arms down. Interlacing the hands at the base of the head, just using the hands to create a bit of length through the back of the neck, crown of the head reaching up, lower ribs in, and then keep grounding down through the, uh, the sitting bones as you inhale, lift the sternum up, lift the eyes, and then exhale to let the chin drop in and just see curve through the spine, elbows can draw in, and then taking an inhale, lifting up through the sternum, lift through the eyes, and then exhale, chin dropping in, C curving through the upper body, and then inhaling, and then exhaling and then inhale coming back upright holding here for a moment take another in breath as you exhale let's take a side bend holding the hands behind the head maybe looking up towards the ceiling and then inhale center exhale side bend to the left right sitting bone stays down looking up to the right inhale center one more time exhale over to the right left sitting bone down and then let's release that right hand down a lot of space between your hand and your hip and then extend that left arm up and over drop the right shoulder away from the ear keep that left sitting bone down open breath make sure that right shoulder is not scrunched up near your ear trying to drop it away and then turn the eyes to look forward. Now taking an inhale. As you exhale, just keep the torso where it is. Let's bring that left hand down. Let the head relax down. Imagine someone's pulling you up through the left fingertips to come all the way up to standing, stacking the spine, stacking the head. Left hand stays lengthening out, palm is facing forward. Take an inhale. And then as you exhale, turn the eyes to look over to the right and then as you inhale, we're going to come back and look towards the left and turn the, the, palm, the palm to face the back, thumb pacing down. So we're internally rotating that left shoulder. 
and then as you inhale, release the palm to face forward and turn the eyes to look back to the right. And inhale to look to the left, turn the palm to face back, thumb facing back, and then releasing. We just go one more time like that. Inhale, and then exhale. And then inhale back to center. Just keep that left hand reaching out for a moment and let's drop that right ear down. And option here to just wrap that left arm behind you, taking that right hand up behind the left ear. Just taking a couple of moments here, just opening up that left side of the neck, just using the weight of that right hand to stretch it open, that space in between the left ear and the tip of the left shoulder. Easy breathing. And then release that top hand, bring the head up, releasing the back hand, inhaling, and then exhale. Just walking your hands forward just to where you can. And then let's walk the hands back up and swapping the legs around. So left leg is in front, if you're in a seated position on the mat. And once again, we're going to interlace the hands at the base of the head. So just starting here, lengthening up through both sides of the waist, taking an inhale. Let's start to lift the sternum up, lift the eyes, and then exhale, C curve through the spine, letting the elbows draw in, chin dropping in, and then inhale. Lifting up through the sternum, Lift through the eyes, inhale, and then exhale, drawing the elbows in as you take the C curve, and then inhale, extending, lifting the eyes, and then exhale. And then inhale, coming back to center. Now holding here for just a moment, exhaling. On your next in breath, let's lengthen up. And then as you exhale, take a side bend over to the left. Eyes can look up to the right. And then inhale, center. Side bend to the right, eyes lifting up to the left. Inhale, center. And then exhale, side bend to the left, looking up to the right. This time, let's release that left hand down. Walking the left hand a little bit further away from the left hip, but keep that right sitting bone grounding down. Extend the right arm up and over, dropping the left shoulder away from the left ear, let's find the breath. And then turn the eyes to look forward, bring that right arm down and then let the head relax down. Take an inhale as you exhale, imagine someone's Gently just lengthening you up as you stack the spine up, stack the head up. Keep reaching out through the right hand, palm is facing forward, fingers are lengthening out. And then turn the eyes to look over the left shoulder. And this left hand just gently lengthening out as well. Taking an inhale here. As you exhale, turn the eyes to look over towards the right shoulder and rotate that left palm to, or the right palm, sorry, to face back and the thumb to face back as well. So we're internally rotating this right shoulder. And then take an inhale to open it back out and turn the eyes to look back towards the left. Exhale, going again, palm facing back, thumb facing back as you look to the right. And then inhale, look to the left as the palm comes forward. Last one, palm facing back, thumb facing back as you look to the right and then coming back to center. Keep holding this right palm so it faces forward and then dropping the left ear down to the shoulder. Option here to just wrap that right arm behind the back, maybe bringing that left hand up and over just behind the right ear, using the weight of that hand just to encourage some opening through the right side of the neck in between the tip of the right shoulder and the right ear. Easy breathing, noticing if there's any space that's opening up. And then let's release that top hand, bring the head back up, release the arms out, taking an inhale. And then as you exhale, walking forward, just to where you can. 
Continue to press the sitting bones back as you lengthen out through both sides of the waist. And then let's walk the hands back up on the next inhale. And just taking a little moment, just in your upright position. You can keep the eyes open or close them down. Just feeling into the length of the spine. Just noticing any difference with this short practice. Just from how you were feeling at the beginning to how you're feeling now. And then when you're ready, you can open your eyes. Thank you so much for joining me today and I'll see you next time.